Hello, I'm Jerry Rigged, and this is the Duskers Daily Challenge for October 7th, 2018. Looking at yesterday's leaderboard, Mustika 21 took the top score with an 831, good drone health, a little bit of damage, and uh, ship scan. Actually, yeah, pretty on par with Decavoid, just a difference in drone health. Longfellow player, uh, Decavoid scored a 781, Longfellow player a 765. Dead Madness and Ricky Matron, a 735. The Integrator and Deno, 715. Wow. Mm. I scored a 695, uh, having to basically bail after screwing some things up pretty royally. Where did I take the damage from? Am I thinking of the wrong day? I'm not thinking of the wrong day. Where did I take the damage from? Radiation, right. Yeah, that was my fault. Quietus 1-1 one, one, and Reuven a 675. And then we have LB with a 665. And Marvun in 13th with a 640. Missing fuel, perhaps? Maybe. Today, it is extraordinarily late. And I should take a lesson from LB and my own medicine, basically, my own warnings not to play so late. But uh, even with my eyes watering, and I'm basically going to crash as soon as I'm done recording this video, uh, you know, it should be an interesting experience. Hopefully better than yesterday, but honestly, I was more awake then, so who knows. There's another yawn. And I'm temporarily blinded. Today we have Cannon and Stealth with below average drone health. I can't even wipe off my eyes because of my glasses. Uh, let's see, Stealth with below average drone health. Three infestations on a medical A with poor integrity. This is going to go fantastically terrible. That's pretty much a given at this point. Big ship, pretty huge ship. There's three infestations, medical A. Nothing is good about this. D36. Survey could be good, could be bad. All right, so there's at least There's a turret. I'd like to keep that. Oh, no, 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 no. So, yep, this is going to be a short run. Actually,
If I can do this quickly enough, maybe, maybe. I'll make positive use of this turret. So that could have gone a lot worse. when my stealth went off, but, uh, yeah, that could have gone badly. Oh, God, that scared the crap out of me. Son of a bitch! I'm just terrible with my timing tonight. But no apparent slime. <sighs> Seventeen, thirteen, and ten all in the bottom section. <sighs> Alright, as far as I can see, things are fine. That's also four minutes away, so. There's the generator. Oh, there's a swarm in there. Great. I am probably not going to get through this unscathed. Unscathed? Unscathed. Um, that basically means I can't get further onto the ship. going to uh, consider options, but I'm thinking I'm probably actually done. The main problem being I can empty out room 8 pretty handily, actually. I can't really do it safely. Well, no six minute slime or er, radiation. There's definitely several in there.
one minute for 17, 13, and 10. Oh, look, 17. Oh, okay. Yeah, so that's terrible. I may actually lose access to the rest of the ship. So that's definitely an unpleasant thing. All right, possibly fuel. Which one's 27? Aha. So much angry. Alright, I think I'm done with this ship. These swarms are... These swarms are definitely angry. And it sounds like there's one in 10 and 11. And I don't really trust, given the number that I know there are, there are at least, I'd say there's at least 30 swarm, probably 50 or 60 at this point. So, I don't really trust that two of them aren't going to go out a door and take it down in extremely short order. Um, so, I don't even know that I want to check R18 or A4. I guess I'm done with R4, right? It sounds safe enough. I'm hopeful. Oh look, what's this? R2. B and R2. Go ahead and do it. R18! Hey, well that saves me a room, right? Son of a bitch. Oh, nope. Not even gonna bother. I'm not going to risk D24 breaking either. Um, I 
I'll okay. do this. They're all the way over at the generator. So... Hey, it's one more room that I would have gotten otherwise. Alright, so there's nothing else I can do. The other half of the ship was probably powered from R-17. And that room started slimed, so... Yeah. I got in there reasonably quickly, and I wouldn't have trusted it. That one scrap might make a difference. I wish I'd been able to get into R15, checks that. Um, but not worth not worth taking the radiation damage, that's for sure. Uh, so at this point, I have a couple rooms of prime candidates. I'm going to go ahead and hit 10, just in case it blows open 19, then I don't have to worry about ventilating 7. It didn't. Shame. But I know there was a swarm in there, so that was a good shot. And I'm going to hit four, because that's got a potential to blow open some other doors. More than seven does, at least. And hey! It did. So. Such a mean ship. Such a mean ship. And that is all of my tools used. I could have taken out the slime over that generator, but wasn't really worth it. Total of 605, only four scrap. Starting score of 500. No fuel, even though I did find it, and one sh or one drone upgrade, which was a turret, which at least served a purpose today. And that, well, you know, some people had worse. It looks like the other infestation was sentries, and LB and Dano did a phenomenal job dealing with those. With a 745 for Dano and a 680 for LB. Dano also had ship scan and appears to have either gotten two sentries, but either way got max drop from two sentries. And LB only got three scrap from however many, whether it was one or two. And yeah... Smith, a 645. Longfellow, same as me, 605. Dargard, a 545. Dano and LB played a lot longer, too. I wonder if... I wonder how they dealt with the slime room. That room was too small to... to just deal with. I wonder if they vented it or what. Interesting. So if you haven't done your run yet, good luck. If you have, leave a comment with your own experience and strategies for a ship like this. Overall, not a pleasant ship with sentries, slime, and swarm. And some especially angry swarm. Lots of especially angry swarm, as a matter of fact. I'd, at least three sets of swarm. Possibly four that I discovered. And I only got halfway through the ship. Plus at least one vent. Uh, there's a lot of things that can go wrong in this ship. So I'm quite happy with the score that I got. If you'd like to check out other videos. You can see Marvin Copper. Dano 416. LB. Mustika 21. Dargard. Decavoid. Merkaller. Quarantoth. And Agenten 1999. All listed in the video description. If you enjoyed. Do please like. And have a good day.